This is Subovon coming at you in HD. Hillbilly definition. I mean, you know, I was over there at the helicopter library where you can just pull up and borrow one if you need it. And this guy starts shooting. There you go. My hat is famous, dude. I mean, cheese and crackers. When they start shooting at you just for stealing a chopper in this game. You know what? Something else is out of control is this guy in the orange t-shirt. First CEO we associate ourselves with. And uh, it was a mistake. And it's a damn good thing that Hat here knows when to grab himself some government bailout. I guess he's not going to survive this one. We're going to need a new tune. But he did. He did. Well, momentarily. <laughs> Had he not been wearing that silly hat of his, he might have actually lived through the whole damn thing. Serves him right for following some dude in an orange t-shirt, I say. You got to watch out who you take advice from these days. And hey, uh, speaking of which, somebody should grab that parachute. The game is gonna give us a new tune for free, but the shoot's a pricey. If you take that tone with me again, I'll come over there and shove that phone up your... Hello? Hello? Ugh. Boss. Hi there. So you get yourself a nice place to work out of. You hire Bye. somebody completely overqualified to sit at the front desk. And you have to be nice to them. And encouraging. Because one day they'll be talking to the IRS on your behalf. And you don't want any of those people mad at you when you're CEO. Now about the map in the map room here. I want to know how long it takes for somebody to sit in front of it and figure out that the guy who sold it to us ripped us off by cutting off the sides. Now I ain't wet behind the ears no more because it's been a long time since I've taken a shower. But I wasn't quite prepared for how ugly the world of business would be on my first watch. An agonizing man under a strange translucent bridge. What kind of business plan is going on around here? And look at Hat figuring the guy is done for and ain't gonna shoot him. He should have known better. That's the first thing he ought to have done. All right, now here is a really low blow. These guys left a bunch of scum on the beach to set us up to get fined by the Environmental Protection Agency. Man, that burns me. Hang on, hang on. It's time for Hat to do something else to horrify your mama. Speaking of which, let's talk company philosophy for a moment. I'm thinking that in the pursuit of profitability, we should roll in some good intentions. You know, a path to hell, if you will. I just think that commercial enterprises like these should adhere to strict, safe guidelines set up to protect the consumer. See, this is the problem. It's profits over accountability for this guy, and he's reckless. We've hired a good accountant, and he's gonna help us keep on our heads straight. Yep. You better believe we picked the building right next to the best barbecue joint in town, too, because we know what we're doing this for. I'm saying the company is going to stand for something like coal hard cash and suit suitcases. Is that what was in those damn crates? You know, those better be frilly suitcases from Paris or some other place that sells good coffee and pastries or we're going to be pretty mad. Just remember what I told you, nice and easy. And don't forget your landing gear. 
all. That's the reject button, you spineless bonefish. <laughs>